ba mag-compare ng fractions? Let me explain. Pero bago yan, remind lang kita na ikaw, hindi mo dapat kinocompare ang sarili mo sa iba. Okay, let's go back here. Comparing fractions, we are going to use greater than, less than, or equal to. Now, to compare this, gamit tayo ng cross multiplication. Okay? So, we have two-thirds. Is it greater than, less than, or equal to 5 over 9? Oh, let's see. Let's multiply 2 and 9. 2 times 9, that's correct, 18. 3 times a 5, that is 15. Now, let's compare the product, 18 and 15. Is it greater than, less than, or equal? Dahil mas mataas si 18 kesa kay 15, that is greater than. Okay, how about 4 over 5 and 6 over 7? So, we multiply 4 times 7, that's 28. Correct? And then, 5 times 6, ilan yan? 30. Now, let's compare 28 and 30. Is it greater than, less than, or equal? Dahil mas maliit si 28 kesa kay 30, you use less than. Kung sino yung maliit doon, nakatutok yung symbol natin, ha? How about number 3? 3 over 5, i-compare natin with 9 over 15. Oh, let's try, ha? 3 times 15, that's 45, correct? How about 5 times 9? Oh, ilan? 45 din, di ba? So, 45 and 45, anong symbol natin? Equal. Okay, now, number 4, 7 over 8, I-compare natin, is it greater than, less than, or equal to 3 over 4? Comment your answer in our comment section. And please, follow our page and share our videos para manami pang matuto sa math. At lagi tandaan, let's spread the love of math at mag-aaral ng mabuti. Bye!